Hey guys and welcome back to the big build. I'm not sick anymore. I can hear the size relief everywhere. Now as you can see, I've actually added the houses in behind here. So I did it off camera because it's quite boring to watch, I know that. So, well, there you go. But I decided to start in here and we're going to put some backboards in. We're going to put a couple in now, but I'm going to go on to something more, something different. And we're going to come back to this around the other edge in there shortly, well, a little bit later. But I wanted to show you that I'm actually doing this because we want to make the backboards really make it. So, uh, you know, let's add them in, shall we? Right, we're going to add a few roads. And again, I'm not going to show you all of this. Just to, I'm basically just showing you this to say, look, I'm doing it. I'm going to put some paths in and stuff. And so this road, this double road where the building is now, doesn't have a path at the moment. In a minute, it will. There you go. There it is. Oh, yep, there it is. So it's, you've seen it before. I don't need to. I don't need to show you again, really. So we're going to place some buildings, and uh, all this area will get done today, or generally done at least. We're going to paint it. We're going to add a, some trees and bits and bobs around it, and uh, and this is finally done. We're going to take out those bits of road which are just strewn across the, the area there. And then next episode, we're going to do the other side and we're going to get the houses in and then we're going to finally get out of this city. Now, I'm, I'm bored of the city as you are, actually. But uh, it's got to be done and we have to do it properly. There's no point doing it otherwise. So, now, if you remember, we had some other sort of uh, football ground there, but I didn't. I found this one, which looks much nicer. So I, I ditched it. I was going to put this the other one here originally. And I actually did a whole filming thing where I put everything round and... Uh, You'll see the car park the other side, and I did that after I placed the uh, the other one in. But uh, this one's so much better. Now, th those ground stands are actually from a race course. It says a race course, so but they work perfectly, don't they, for uh, sort of the, the old 1960s type uh, standing sort of uh, grandstands you had. Because at these days, you have to sit, but uh, in those days, you need to stand there, which is great. So that's what they are, and uh, that's the idea. Now, I moved some of these... The car parts around again. I'm not going to show exactly what I do. It's quite boring. We're going to put later, later on. We'll put some more cars on, but probably not this episode. But yeah. All right. So we paint. Start painting now. And uh, we start with some tarmac. We put some grass and uh, all bits and bobs around. We put some trees on there shortly as well. So I'm trying to find something to match that hill there. That's that's quite difficult. We want to match some the uh, the pitch as well on the edges. And obviously that's where the end of the canal is, so that's where the boat's going to end up. That's where the uh, the portal is. I have no idea where this is going to work. If it doesn't, we just have to move the, move the portal to off off the board there. And we have to do something else. But we're going to try it. Hopefully it'll work. I still haven't actually run a boat down there yet. Now, we're just putting low, low level sort of trees here because we're not really aiming. We're not... It's... Hopefully the train's going to be going past you. You'll look at it and think, oh, that's nice. You don't need lots and lots of detail. Like this side where the canal is, because we've got the canal boat there, we, we'll put a few more nicer trees in later on, but uh, in a little bit more detail. We'll put the same amount of detail on the factories eventually, but we'll do down further on. I, I, whether I do it on camera, I don't know yet. I haven't decided. But uh, it'll look... Exactly the same all the way down. Now this side I've decided to make to more of a wasteland. It's more of a field. That's been sitting there for ages, hasn't it? That bit of tarmac there. Okay, for about time we actually uh, sort of flattened this off. The thing was, when we put the uh, the water in, there was a hole and I just couldn't get rid of it. So the only way I could do it is put this spline here. And we're going to have a building quite close. And uh, we use we we'll use that sort of uh, as a car park. Now I've got uh, I've got something in mind there, which I, it's the same near me on the canal near me. That's why that's why I'm using that. Hopefully it'll work. And I'll, I'll put some more details, and we'll do we'll do another episode. Right. So right now, just like further up in the more detailed area, we basically make everything grey because it's uh, concrete, and that's pretty much what these these factory areas have is just concrete everywhere it's not nice but uh, that's what it is and just doing this i just need to give it life because everything was just green the same green the base green which i had before but uh now 
No, that's the direction. I'll move the direction. Otherwise, if you don't do that, again, it gets very uniform. You do not want it looking uniformed. Different sizes, different directions. Just keep doing it layer and layer. Just think of a, a normal oil painting or something. You start with the base and you just keep layering it. And that's what you're doing here. That's why we keep going back to different areas because we're doing different layers each time. That track, which is at the moment, so there's bits of track that we get rid of, but we're leaving there right now because they're different types of the same track, which we might use in different places. So I just want them uh, accessible right now. Still haven't decided what I'm going to put in that area yet. yet. But uh, again, I decide those two tracks going up into the um, the station there, the, uh, the freight station, we'll probably put a wall up there. And once again, we need to put a little bit more detail around where the train actually goes, rather than actually the uh, the other areas. So, we're not quite done here. We're we'll walking one more episode of the general build, and we're we'll doing probably another episode of the a uh, bit more detailing around here, and then that will be the city done. So maybe two episodes. I'm not going to do everything on camera, just like the house at the beginning. It's you know, you you've seen me do it. If you want to go to the early episodes, you can see me placing houses. And I know it's quite boring, but I have to do it. Otherwise, it's never going to get built. And it's always, it's always difficult deciding whether I put something on camera or I don't put something on camera because you're putting the hours in. And you really do, you know, the feeling is, oh, I want to put everything on. But then I do record most of it. And then like on this episode here, I've cut out about three quarters of what I've actually filmed. It's, it's just, it doesn't work as a narrative for, for what you see, you guys see. Some of it's out of order. Even even that the uh, the backboards at the beginning, they're out of order of what I did later on. But as I was doing it, it all makes sense. But putting it on a video, maybe not. But we will be some more backboards this side behind here. There'll be more rolling trees and rolling trees. Yeah, okay. I hope the trees don't roll, but uh, rolling hills and trees and woods and things. And then we go into the more town area down here. We go. Now, I actually moved this down to the right a bit more in the end because we're, we're going too far on the left there into the uh, into the into the park here, which we're going to create. But uh, yeah, we just lower that down and it. I, I, I'm going to do. Um, Right at the end, I'll show you it properly without all the horrible little circles. We actually put it into play mode and I can actually show you actually what we end up with. And it does look quite nice. Um, the bat boards are never going to look perfect when you're up close. Just calm. But uh, as you can see, what I'm trying to do here, I'm trying to layer them. So I put something in front of something else and we sort of layer again. It's like a painting. You start off with the back layer and you gradually move forward. So. Whether I keep every last thing on here, I don't know. We'll just see. But uh, this is meant to be a factory here, so I'm trying to put some factory backgrounds in. And you can see I've got the, that long house thing on that that background there. We've got some more, here we go, some more trees here. We can merge everything together. And this little one here is perfect, because look, you put it in front of the, well, you put it in front, come on, yeah, that's it. And it merges in the bushes there to the town area. So using these little ones and you can hide. I'm going to put a tree in front of this uh, this one here. And it's not perfect, but you get the idea. You're, you're trying to hide the uh, the knitting of the two of the two backboards, the edges of the two backboards. That by accident, so we used that before. I'm using these on a simple route. Again, a bit more depth, a few more trees there. Now that particular backboard there with the long house we use on the other side behind the big buildings as well, the, uh, the high rise buildings. We got a few more sort of low pixel trees. Right, we're back to the roads again over here. So again, I'm not going to show you every last thing. It's I'm just showing you so this is what I'm doing and then we move on. I think it's a same a lot of the time it is a narrative i'm trying to tell a story of what i'm doing to you guys so and if there's something which needs a bit more detail needs a bit more needs to be shown a bit more i would do that but one if i if i've done something before there's no point in me showing you again and again and again here we go here's a another little edit i took ages just doing that little bit of corner there for some reason i don't know why 
Now try, I'm moving it across that road because I want to put some houses there. I'll make sure I've got enough space. Now the house, the house selection here is quite important. Now we're in a built up area. This is why it's bricked up that the uh, the station all the, and all the way along there, the, the tracks above. It's because this land's meant to be expensive. It's meant to be used. Otherwise you just have a a bank with uh, with earth which we'll have further up so we need, we need to make it look like there's a lot of things here because you can't space it out too much so it has to be packed in around here so I, I play this three or four times put different things on you're gonna see different houses appear there and not and, and it'll probably end up changing again as well I've said it before, I procrastinate, I can't help it. <laughs> Probably have to put some gardens uh, walls behind there. That area there, which is uh, the tarmac area, I still don't know what we're going to do. We, we should put some factories down there. I haven't found anything really to fit, so that's the problem. There we go, a few more there. Then we go around the corner, and we need to meet them around there. We'll, we'll put some trees behind where the water is. We're going to try and hide that bit of water up there at the top. Because remember the uh, the portals around that area. We want to. We don't want the boats just disappearing. You can see it. So because the boat won't go through to that bit. As I say, if it doesn't work, we'll, we'll play with it. We we'll just change it, and I'll show you guys what I end up doing. Right, so we, I, here we're going to put some big houses, well, big shops. So we've got the station right in front of us at the bottom. We're gonna, that's the last thing we're going to do on this episode. We're actually going to build that station properly. We've got the stairs going up, all the bits and bobs and the paraphernalia of it. Here we go, we're actually doing that right now. In fact, we're going to put the end wall in for here. We don't put the bridge in yet, we'll, put, we'll do that next episode. Put the end wall in, we move these walls down. Now either sign it. Yep, there we go. Put the platform down as well. Now first of all, I put two of these brick things. One on top of the other. It's quite steep, but we are limited what we've actually got to actually use here. So I put one this side, one on the other side. Move the house a little bit. That's it. And one up above. Move it across. Now in theory, I thought that's great, we'd just use that with them. But then I thought this. Now in a moment, you'll, so we move it back, and you'll see why in a second. I want to give enough space for something else. There we go, that. That's why that was. I've tested this out beforehand, put it there, placed it, taking it away, and now putting it so you guys can see what I'm doing. A lot of this is actually done like that. Now I'm only going to show you one side, and on the other side we've got, I just put in because there's no point. It's the duplication, really. That's it. Uh, just lower it down a little bit. Try not to lower the wall down while I'm doing it. Now, I'll put the end wall in here. You'll see what I'm putting it in a sec. We're going to hire up a little bit more. I'm not sure we're going to end up using this wall. Because we've got the... Uh, we've got the main walls, which is sort of a stone, where that arrow is on the left-hand side near the track. You've got the wall there, retaining wall to the right, where everything sort of holds up. You can see I've done both sides now. And then you had that that wall. And I don't know. It's, a th it's three different brick types. Could it be done three different times? Yes, possibly, but I'm not sure. This, on the other hand, it's just, it's the same stone as the, uh, the the main retaining wall, so yeah, that's fine. So here we go. This is the end now. Let you see. So we got the back wall on the right. Then it doesn't look too bad. Again, it's never going to look perfect when you're this close, but it does give you a bit more depth. Before you could just see straight off the board, and I didn't like that. Nice sky, isn't it? There goes the uh, the football ground, the road before. Before we put some more gardens. There's our station. Oh, that was a bit fast. That uh, link wasn't. It? Oh yes, I should have done. Oh, I wasn't very good at all. Oh well. Okay. So this is the board as we got it. 
So in the next episode, we're going to do the middle there and we're going to go to the right and we're going to move the houses down. I'll probably do a little bit of it off uh, camera again just to finish up. But uh, that's it for this episode. I'd like to thank everyone for watching. If you liked it, please press the like button. If you want to see more, please subscribe. And if you press that ding dong bell button, even tells you and put more stuff on. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Cheers and bye bye.